Cross country is a disciplined battle against the field and yourself. Coaching a highly effective mindset for both genders is a unique challenge and one that Sherwin Payette stepped up to meet when he returned to the high school ranks to lead Ukudu this season. In the past few seasons, these kids at Ukudu, they, they didn't win a meet at all. Zero meet, they were at the bottom. So the first meet this season, you know, we, we won. You know, we won the first meet and the kids were just so excited. They started believing and they started buying into the program. And once they bought into the program, you know, uh, the history, you know, uh, the rest is history. His mission to his team was simple. Before they even set foot on the course, before they even laced up, change the culture. Um, when I came in, I just noticed that a bunch of these kids, they, you know, they would come into practice, don't come into practice. They won't text me or show up. And, you know, I just had to hold a team meeting and, I, you know, I showed up, told them, hey, this is different now. I'm here. Uh, we're going to change the culture. You got to show up to practice all the time. Hot sun, early morning on a weekend. And, you know, we just made sure to uh, establish that, build that program, and the kids understood what it took, and, you know, we were consistent after that. Many of the Bulldogs ran for him when they were in middle school at Estumbo, so Coach had to adjust his mentality to match their maturity. You know, the distance now is you're running a 5K. Um, middle school is just 1.5. Uh, middle school, you can kind of pace yourself a little bit and then build up and finish the, you know, that last mile quick. In high school, you gotta fight for position. Sometimes you gotta start like at a 540 mile and you gotta try to sustain us, you know, sustain that and just tolerate the pain as much as you can, that whole 5K. Now the impact the team had together as a unit was immediate. They earned victories, grew each week, and ultimately took third in the All Island Meet. You know, this year they put the public school and private schools back together, uh, which was awesome. We were able to compete with much more runners, much more schools, right? Um, and at the end of the season, man, uh, they called us for the third place trophy and they were just so, they were just so stoked. So I told them, hey, all that individual stuff, we can put it aside, right? This is what we worked for. And, you know, they were all so happy and I'm so happy for our seniors, especially, you know, going through those four years into, you know, a program that's just kind of building from the ground up and to leave their senior year winning a trophy and something they can remember for the rest of their lives. You know, I just want to dedicate this to them as well. And at season's end, in an emotional social media post, Coach promised, this is just the beginning. Well, we're just gonna continue to build on, get some more people to buy into the program. I know um, a bunch of the kids in, in the program right now are telling me that they have a bunch of friends that are interested now. You know, they, they saw the camaraderie that we built. Uh, they saw that we were having fun. You know, we're just gonna keep uh, building this program. Hopefully we win a ship before I leave or, you know, um, during their time there. But, you know, we're gonna take it one step at a time.